Hello friends, in this video I am going to make you familiar with the terms that are used in the chapter 1 of global finance course. So let's begin. Absolute advantage. The ability of an individual party or country to produce more of a product or service with the same inputs as another party. That's called absolute advantage. Comparative advantage. A theory that everyone gains if each nation specializes in a production of those goods that it produces relatively most efficiently and imports those goods that other countries produce relatively most efficiently. Angel Investor Angel Investor is an investor who provides capital for small business startups. Appreciation In the context of exchange rate changes, a rise in the foreign exchange value of a currency that is pegged to other currencies or to gold. It is also called a revaluation. Bid. Bid is the price that a dealer is willing to pay to purchase foreign exchange or a security. It is also referred to as a bid rate. Branch. Branch is a foreign operation that is not incorporated in the host country, in contrast to the subsidiary. Capital markets. The financial markets of various countries in which various types of long-term debt and or ownership securities or claims on those securities are purchased and sold. Capital life cycle. The changing capital needs in both form, maturity and amount which a firm experiences from inception through maturity is called the capital life cycle. Crowdfunding. The practice of funding a startup business or enterprise of some kind by raising money in small amounts from large number of people, typically via the internet. Convertible currency. A currency that can be exchanged freely for any other currency without government restrictions. Effective tax rate. Actual taxes paid as a percentage of actual income before tax. Euro. A single new currency unit adopted by 11 participating members of European Union, European Monetary System in January 1999, replacing their individual currencies. Eurobank. Eurobank is a bank or a bank department that bids for time deposits and make loans in currencies other than that of a country where the bank is located. Euro currency. Euro currency is a currency deposited in a bank located in a country other than the country issuing the currency. Euro dollar. Euro dollar is a US dollar deposited in the bank outside of United States. A euro dollar is a type of euro currency, also termed as euro dollar deposit. London Interbank Offered Rate, short form is LIBOR. It's the deposit rate applicable to the interbank, interbank loans in London. LIBOR is used as a reference rate for many international interest rate transactions. 
FIBOR stands for Frankfurt Interbank Offered Rate. MIBOR is Madrid Interbank Offered Rate. PIBOR is Paris Interbank Offered Rate. And CYBOR is Singapore Interbank Offered Rate. Foreign exchange risk. The likelihood that an unexpected change in exchange rates will alter the home currency value of a foreign currency cash payments expected from a foreign source. Also, the likelihood that an unexpected change in exchange rates will alter the amount of home currency needed to repay a debt denominated in the foreign currency. Home currency. Home currency is the currency of the company's incorporation, the currency of financial reporting purposes. Offer rate. The price of sale or ask as in bid ask and bid offer. Multinational enterprise, short form is MNE. It is a firm that has operating subsidiaries, branches, or affiliates located in foreign con countries. North American Free Trade Agreement, short form is NAFTA. A treaty allowing free trade and investment between Canada, United States, and Mexico. Operating cash flows. The primary cash flows generated by a business from the conduct of trade, typically composed of earnings, depreciation and amortization and changes in net working capital. Pass through or pass through period. Pass through period is the time it takes for an exchange rate change to be reflected in market prices of products or services. Private equity, PE. Private equity is the asset ownership in a business that is not publicly traded. Private equity investments are typically made by private equity firms or private equity funds. Public debt. The debt obligation of a governmental body or sovereign authority. Quota. Quota is a limit, a mandatory or voluntary, set on the import of the product. Quotation. In foreign exchange trading, the pair of prices, bid and ask, at which the dealer is willing to buy or sell foreign exchange. Risk. The likelihood that an actual outcome will differ from an expected outcome. The actual outcome could be better or worse than expected. Two-sided risk. Although in common practice, risk is more often used in the context of an adverse outcome, that is one-sided risk. Risk can exist for any number of uncertain future situations, including future spot rates, or the results of political events. Tariff A duty or tax on imports that can be levied as a percentage of cost or as a specific amount per unit of import. Terms of trade The weighted average exchange ratio between a nation's export prices and its import prices used to measure gains from trade. Gains from trade refer to increases in total consumption resulting from production specialization and international trade. 
Theory of Comparative Advantage Based on the concept of absolute value in which each country specializes in the production of those goods for which it is uniquely suited, the theory of comparative advantage states that exchange between these countries will result in all parties or countries being better off through specialization and exchange than by attempting to produce all at home. Value of Death The period in capital raising for a startup firm between seed capital and more formal firms such as an angel financing and venture capital. So named because many business startups fail in this stage as a result of not finding funding resources. Venture Capitalist VC an investor or fund that provides capital and funding to early stage business startups. The startups are typically considered of high potential growth and possibility as a result of unique intellectual property or technology. Working capital management, the management of the net working capital requirements, that is account receivable plus inventories less accounts payable of the firm. Cross rate, the exchange rate between two currencies. Direct quotation, home currency, of price, home currency price of one unit of the foreign currency. Indirect quotation, foreign currency price of one unit of home currency. Spot rates. Spot, spot rate is the effective exchange rate of foreign currencies for delivery on approximately the current day. Forward exchange rate. An agreed upon price at which two currencies will be exchanged at the same at some future date. Thanks for watching.